Hi guys, welcome to DIY with Jojo where we do easy, fun and affordable DIY projects. So in today's episode, we're going to do a thrift haul. I enjoy watching thrift haul videos so I get to see the treasures that other people get. So in today's episode, I'm going to show you the treasures that I got from two shops that I went to. One was an XUK shop in Donholm that I got to know of courtesy of Bodley Isa. She's a YouTuber and I'm going to leave a link of her YouTube channel down in the description box below. And the next place was Gikomba. So without wasting more time, let's get to the haul. So the first item that I got was uh, this vest. I did get two of them and they were 400 bob each. And what I plan on doing with the vests is uh, playing around with spray paints and water. So you have to stick around and uh, see the results in the next video. So the next item that I did, did get was uh, this glass bowl. I loved it because of the texture and it was only 100 bob. Though the paint has chipped, but this is nothing that spray paint cannot fix. So the next item were this apple shaped plates. They are too small, yeah. So what I plan to do with them is um, one will be stationed at my coffee station. And then um, the other one I'll just use it as a deco piece. Next item was this glass tray which was uh, 100 shillings. Yeah, and it's quite heavy. So this glass vest would be ideal for grouping items on the tray. The next item was this photo frame, which was uh, 100 shillings. So the next item that I got was this glass container. And uh, I'm planning on uh, putting it on my back hat. And maybe I'll put ice cubes or anything, but it will be on my back hat. Oh, sorry. And this vest was uh, 200 shillings. The next item that I got was this vest. It was 200 pop. And, and what I loved most about this vest was uh, the texture. Yes. So... I think I'll leave this one the way it is. I'll not mess around with it. Yeah, it was a good find. I did get a lot of verses and the next one is still a verse. This was uh, 200 shillings. I loved it because of the lines. This was 100 shillings. So that's all for the XUK shop. Now next I'll show you the things that I got from Gikomba. So to start us off, there's this small plates that I did get and the, the seller said that it's made of stoneware. I loved it because of the hammered look that it, it has and I thought this would look nice on my back hat and maybe I'll spell it with limes. Yeah. So the next item that I did get was this cute bowl and what I loved most about it is the inside is glass. Yeah, so I'll sell this maybe between the black plate and this one. One of the two will go on my back hat and uh, I'll put lines on them. And then the other one, I'll use it maybe as a planter and, plant, and uh, put plants. Or maybe I'll do, I'll just style it on top of a book. These plates and uh, together with the black one, they were 150 shillings. So the next item that I was so excited to find were these photo frames. I did see Isa, she had uh, gotten some from, uh, but a different kind from uh, the XUK shop in Donholm. But I was thrilled to find this one. So this one was 200 pop and I did get two. So this is how they are and then I did get this photo frame, this was a hundred shillings, also this was a hundred shillings, that's such a bargain. 
so the next item that I did get was uh, these small plates I believe yeah and uh, I'll use it in my coffee station and I'll put the spoons I'll use it to style the spoons and this was 200 shillings it was a bit pricier but it's quite heavy so the next item that I did get were these coasters and uh, they are stored coasters and what I plan to do with them is something similar to a gut coasters So keep it here to see how I will transform these coasters. So I did get two types. So I have this type. This is a this is heavier. It's more of a stone, or should I say marble? So what I plan to do with them is something similar to a guard coasters, and I'll display them on top of my coffee table. So the next item that I did get from Gikomba was uh, this ceramic pot and from the moment I saw it I knew that I had to get it and um, it's, uh, it's quite large and what I'll do with it is maybe use it as a planter so I'll look for a plant and um, use it here or I'll just leave it like this and style it on top of my console table. So the last item that I did get from Gikomba was this heavy ball and um, I love the texture and the fact that it has a golden rim on top. Yes, but I'm not quite sure what I'll use it for. So if you have any ideas of how I can use this one, kindly leave them in the comment section below. So that's it for today's thrift haul. I hope that you were inspired to go thrifting because you never know the treasures that you're going to find. So if you did enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and let me know down in the comment section below which of my finds did you love the most. And don't forget to subscribe. So until next time, bye!